blueberries as we were getting ready to get on. But uh, that's a fairly easy one. We were talking about you growing it in a container on your balcony. But, you know, blueberries are expensive, and they're, you know, $5 for a quart. I've seen them $5 for half a quart. You know, make sure when you're picking them that they're the, some of the compact ones if you're growing on the uh, balcony. But uh, some of the things you want to remember is you want to bl grow blueberries that have our chill hours, you know. So you, you want to grow ones that are specifically made for the southeast. And you have a good selection of these at Ace Hardware. So if you're thinking about it, you know, this is right right here is Climax. That's a great, great blueberry, mm -hmm. easy to grow. This one's, uh, you know, already got fruit on it. And you're going to, you know, start getting fruit in about another 30 days. And uh, you're going to be able to pick probably from a mature tree around five quarts with a lot of uh, fertilizer on it. Okay. Some of the things blueberries like is good drainage. You know, you got to make sure that's why a container in your garden is going to look good because it does have good drainage. You know, you want to berm up a little bit and they like the soil to be acidic. They want full sun. So some of the things you can do to make the soil acidic is putting pine straw. This will make the soil slightly acidic and they'll like that growing environment. The next thing is they're going to want to have some good organic material. And, you know, black cow, you know, nature best yeah. or mill organite okay. that's another thing what I like to do is put some bone meal in there what this does is help the root system get developed fully developed you know keeping the weeds away also remember that blueberries are shallow rooted that you don't want to rake too hard around there those two disturbs them you know blackberries is another we're going to go with the easiest oh, one black blackberries are easy again an expensive expensive uh, fruit crop, great for you, rich in flavoids and antioxidants. You know, it actually has kind of a pretty flower. This one's kind of wilted, kind of a pinkish white. It but it's, you know, you can put it on a trellis, mm -hmm. put it over a pergola, it gets you that shade, in the, and then you can harvest your crops and sit out there and eat them. Uh, <laughs> Very, very simple, you know, again, compost. I use, like to use uh, Osmocote as a slow release. They don't have a lot of fertilizer demand, but they're a gr easy crop to grow. And, and also, they're beautiful. Uh, some of the, you know, people always ask me about, can you grow raspberries? Didn't mean to get you. But, uh, <laughs> can you? The, the, you can, but they're more grown as an annual because they got to have chill hours. When they ship, you know, you can still, like I say, if you're looking for some, they're at Ace. But... Uh, when they ship, they're already pre-chilled, they're put in the ground, and you'll get one crop out of them. And then you're, you know, it's a little more challenging for raspberries. Grapes are another great, you know, uh, rich in the antioxidants. Yes, yeah, so it's a gr it's a great looking vine, and also has a, you know, foliage again, pergola, mm -hmm. easy to grow. Muscadines are one of I our. I love muscadines. Exactly, and then this is a bunch grape. You know, you can have some bunch grapes. They require a little bit more maintenance, a little more difficulty, you know, in grow uh, keeping them uh, healthy. You know, uh, then you can also use the leaves for the wraps for a lot of uh, a lot of foods you remember with grapes that they like a little bit of organic i like fish emulsion again mill I've organite. Got a fish emulsion in there here's a new product that you can get at ace it's called fruit and citrus vegetable insect control you just put it on on the liquid mm -hmm. on the root system and it makes them uh immune to bug infestation for oh. almost a whole growing season oh, how about that that's fantastic <laughs> that's unbelievable so put away those sprayers yes thank you so much larry uh, for more information about gardening and berries go to larrysgarden.com or you can give them a call at larry's garden and design and installation 346 19